German detectives working on the Madeleine McCann case have reportedly received new tips that could be vital regarding suspect Christian Bruckner, RadarOnline.com has learned. Bruckner is a convicted sex offender who is currently on trial in Braunschweig regarding a string of alleged sexual assaults in Portugal between 2007 and 2017. Three-year-old McCann went missing in May 2007 while on vacation with her parents, Jerry and Kate, in Praia de Luz, Lagos, Portugal. Bruckner is currently on trial for the alleged attack of Hazel Bean, who he is accused of brutally raping in June 2004. He appeared in court last week as he faces charges of three rapes and two sexual assaults. While Bruckner is a prime suspect in the McCann case, he has not been charged in relation to her disappearance, but a source close to the Bean case said information from the trial may prove beneficial to McCann detectives who have hit a bit of a brick wall. New information has been coming in ever since Bruckner appeared in court last week. It's a massive boost for German detectives because their investigation had really hit a bit of a brick wall, a suspect close to the case told The Sun. So they are really pleased about this, and really hope this will give fresh impetus to the investigation into what happened to Madeline, the source continued. They remain convinced Christian Bruckner was either involved in Maddie's disappearance or knows about how Maddie vanished. The highly publicized trial was said to have turned up information about Bruckner that could be vital to the toddler's disappearance. Having his face on TV screens, and in newspapers across the world, has generated fresh calls, tip-offs and leads which they will look into and which they hope could prove vital, the insider said. According to the source, Bruckner was believed to be living a nomadic lifestyle in Portugal at the time of McCann's disappearance. The timeline of where Christian Bruckner was and when during that period is still far from clear, the insider noted. He was living a nomadic lifestyle. He was a drifter going from here to there and he would have come into contact with a lot of people. The police are convinced many of them may not yet have come forward, the source added. The publicity around this case could prompt someone who knows something into doing just that. This is what the German cops are now hoping for, 